today is day three of the seven day engine two challenge. We are starting off the morning with a cantaloupe with some grapes inside cut in half. So I love grapes with cantaloupe and the kids just go crazy over it. So we're gonna enjoy this. Did you drop a grape? Go get it. Check this out. This is from my dad's garden. He just brought it in. This is the early crop because it really doesn't all start um, getting ripe until September. So this is early. But I'm going to start snacking on some of this. Yum. I had two bananas as a snack and now I'm eating raspberries. Raspberries. Um, me and Abigail did some shopping this morning and we didn't bring any food so we got hungry. And so we stopped at Starbucks to get two, like we got four bananas. Um, and so that was just a quick easy way to stay whole food plant based while out but ultimately you could stop at a grocery store but starbucks was right there so we just got bananas there what are you eating abby a peach yummy mm. did you get oh so now i'm gonna eat this this is big is it ripe i don't know sounds crunchy <laughs> no it's still good I'm not gonna eat this. We are in the works of making tostadas yet again. It's a money saving thing. Like, instead of getting seven different meals for seven days, you know, you can just get bulk of one thing and then just have it like every day for lunch. And then next week, make something else for lunch. And then, like, for breakfast, you can get oatmeal and have it every day for breakfast until next week, then have cereal. Get a box of cereal and have it every day for breakfast. So it's it's like a money-saving tip. Also, see this corn? We're making corn today. We're, it's kind of like different every day. Just use what you have and what you're in the mood for. But um, as you can see, I'm burning this corn. And if I were, it's like dry. So if I were to just scrape it, it's all stuck to the pan because there's no oil. Well, if you just take a little bit of water and you pour it around, And that's going to deglaze the pan and the corn will just come right off. No problem. There's an oil-free cooking tip. 